Hey, what's up everyone? Philip with Kogel Apps here. Today I'm going to be showing you how to make WordPress content expire on specific dates. This could be things like WordPress pages, WordPress blog posts, and pretty much any kind of WordPress content piece. If this is your first time around here, I create WordPress tutorials to help you level up your WordPress game. So if you're interested in getting better at WordPress, click that subscribe button. All right, let's hop on the computer. Today we're going to be showing you how to make WordPress posts expire on a specific date. And this can be useful for things like promotions on your site or content that you just want on there temporarily and then to be removed in the near future. So there's a plugin that does that. So if we go to plugins, go to add new here, and then we go to the search bar, type in post expire. And as we can see here, we have a few results here. There's a few different post expiration plugins, but I found this one, the one with the PE logo, and this may change in the future depending on when you're watching this, but post expirator is my favorite one. This one seems to function the best and it never fails and it has never failed on me. Now that we have the plugin installed, let's go to our posts. And this is a fresh install of WordPress. We're gonna click edit on the blog post here. And then, oh, down here on the bottom right, you can see a new tab. And this is basically post expiration. So we can say enable post expiration and we can tell it when to expire. So let's say we wanted to expire September, let's say end of the year, we don't want this post anymore. So we'll say December 30th, and then you can select the time. Down here it says how to expire and it gives you the option to delete it, trash it, private it, or give it a different category. So this gives you quite a bit of flexibility on how you would like to manage your expired posts. So in our case, I don't wanna delete this post. I just want to put it in draft when it's done. So we'll hit update and that's pretty much it. And if we go to our posts here, on the right hand side, it gives you an expiration date. And if you have a lot of posts, you can sort this these posts by clicking the expire button here. If we go to our plugins page and then hit the settings on post expirator, it gives us a few different options on the date format, the time format, we can give it a default uh, category expiration. So if you have multiple categories, you can select, you know, whatever category you want it to go into by default. Maybe you can have a category called expired posts and then by default, they would go there. You can enable email notifications when a post expires. This is definitely handy if you want to keep track of whatever it is that is expiring. And then here you um, enter the emails that you want to send a notification to. And as you can see, it's a very simple process to make content expire on WordPress. All you do is install this plugin and boom, you pretty much can expire anything at any time. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like this video and leave your comments down below. Peace.